Hey friends, what's going on? It's your buddy Keith. We're here in the kitchen of Essex Recording Studios. And today I've got another super cool Zach Wild Les Paul Custom coming from Epiphone. This is the coveted limited edition Buzzsaw model. So as opposed to the traditional black and white bullseye that you get from Zach. This is orange as you can see and you've got this crazy uh, spiral buzzsaw graphic going on. Really nice chrome hardware as opposed to the gold hardware. I think uh, the gold would just be a little too much with the orange color. And then you've got the passive EMG HZ pickups. Acrylic, clear acrylic speed knobs. You've got the rosewood fretboard with the block inlays and that mother of pearl diamond, as you can see, an Epiphone logo. This is a Korean model. You know it's the Korean because it's got the deeper divot there. And of course, on the back, it's got the uh, scarf joint there. Really nice neck. Good piece of wood. You can see the grain, the figuring in the maple there. You've got the block joint at the heel. And then the limited edition custom shop Epiphone logo there, the CE and bin stickers, which by the way, on the fakes, you never get those stickers. For, I don't know why. Same thing with the fake ESPs. They've got these two stickers on the ESPs down here, but on the fakes, they're just never there. And then there's your serial number. The U is the, it's like the, the Udang or Usong factory, but the U is the factory, 07, 2007. So this is a late Korean model. You also know it's Korean because of the blotchy uh, three spirals on the back of the Zach silhouette versus the crisp four on the fakes and also on the later Chinese models. Little hair there. Chrome Grover tuners. That's it. Back looks very good. You've got good binding all the way around. And, I mean, this thing is super clean. There's not much as far as marks or wear or anything on it. It's all really, really good condition. And again, like we were saying, you've got a beautiful neck with a lot of figuring on it. You can kind of see some light, very light flaming in the wood going on, which is very nice. And then you get in here a little bit more and focus. There we go. I mean, that's just premium. You don't get that with the fakes. You really don't. Long discontinued. Uh, it's kind of interesting that Zach had this long relationship with Gibson and Epiphone um, and has parted ways to go to Korea, of all places, to have his new guitars made, his wild audios, which are kind of like a radical take on the classic Les Paul shape and figure. Personally, I like the... Gibson and Epiphone versions better. His wild audios, the the inlays take up the whole um, fretboard, and I'm not a huge fan of that visually. But I've never touched one. I've never played one. So uh, hopefully I'll have my hands on one soon, and I'll be able to give you an up close, detailed review about it. But this is probably the fourth or fifth orange buzzsaw we've had. I've got another one coming in tomorrow, so that will be up. And if you guys want to buy this bad boy, it is for sale. I would say the it looks a little bit more orange. Let me just adjust the lighting. That's that's what it looks like in person. There we go. That's correct. Um, but yeah, if you want to buy this, it's on the website, EssexRecordingStudios.com. Hosted by our good buddies, Reverb.com. So if you go to Reverb, go to the search, type in Zach Wild Buzzsaw. You'll see it there. And uh, other than that, guys, thanks for the support. Uh, we put a po post up on our Facebook, at Essex Recording Studios, and we asked for some more subscribers, and you guys have really followed through. We're just shy of 1,000. We've got a quarter million views on the channel already this first year, um, and I think we hit 965 subscribers a couple minutes ago, 966. So potentially today, we're going to hit that 1,000 mark. Google will start paying my ass, and... Uh, yeah, big things will start happening. Cool. Well, I'm going to sign off because we got a ton of new guitars to do videos of. We got this one 
from the darkness. Yesterday, I was at Dan's house. We bought that. I can't wait to show it to you. We got all these right here. And uh, I'm going to be a busy boy this Sunday. I'll tell you that much. All right, guys. I'll see you very soon in the next video coming right up. Bye.